while we learn about the opposition on the pitch, Wiser learns how to heat my home. Harry, uh, you returned to, to the field last weekend after tough times. You don't tend to get injured that often, um, but um, have you been a good watcher? Has it been tough watching from the sidelines? Um, yeah, no, touch wood so far. It's been, it's been my sort of timing has been pre-injury free, so... It was it was okay to start with, and I probably got a little bit more like you know I was I was kind of jonesing for a game towards more at the end there I'd say, um, but you know it was just it was probably more it sounds weird but like the novelty of it at the beginning because I just didn't really it was something I knew I had an experience um, but yeah definitely good to be back back in the mix and a good performance as well that first half in particular last week uh, yeah didn't actually play the first half so I know that. <laughs> but I know the boys did the, whole, the, the, whole lads, the lads did start really well um, I think our the way we begun the game, we had real. We, we were playing like we had really real clarity. We knew what we were trying to do. I think that playing into the elements actually helped us a little bit in that first half because we knew the way in which we had to go about attacking the game. And uh, Sale, um, typically quite a fast starting team. They've caught us here. We've played them quite a lot recently. We played here. We played them twice here back in June, and they started fast in both of those games. So I think it was quite a big thing. And I think we took it away from them a little bit. Well, the start, uh, the start we had. Coaches and players alike are saying there's a real buzz around the camp at the moment. The last four or five weeks in particular is an energy that we perhaps haven't seen earlier in the season. I think so, yeah. Um, no, it has. The, the vibe's been really good around the club. And it's a weird thing, a vibe, because sometimes it's, you know, sometimes it's good and sometimes it's bad. Uh, or not, you know, it hasn't necessarily been bad here, but maybe we sort of haven't been putting, maybe our, uh, we've kind of manifest in you know, the mood around the club recently back up into the pitch. I think it's why it's very easy as a supporter to get behind or, you know, a player who's injured to get behind a team because you can see the lads playing with a lot of happiness and joy, which I feel like we have been doing. You've been part and parcel of some great success triumphs here at the yeah. club. Rob's talking now about there's almost like a new exeter coming through based around that vibe and that culture that you're now creating. There's a new group and a new... Uh, impetus from you guys as players that you want to drive the club further yeah, no, forward I, I, could, I totally like when uh, Rob says that it really resonates with me because um, you hear commentators and you hear every, loads of people saying actually oh you know that supporters commentators everyone like, oh you know that's that's the old Chiefs or Chiefs are back and all this kind of stuff or you know not even Chiefs any team um, they did it with Leicester for ages as well I remember this really clearly and I feel like it's quite a regressive mindset to have that you are always looking back on something that you've done previously because the team that won that a year or two ago or three years ago or how 10 years ago may not win it now so you have to keep looking to evolve and move forward so I think the idea of like a new exit or a new team and a new phase is, is, a, is a good one You take it into this weekend at Worcester a notoriously tough place to play weird we go up there and it, it just seems tough all the time Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're always, it's always a, a difficult game up there and I know there's no I know there's no relegation uh, this year, but you know they are towards the bottom end of the table, and you know they are. You no know, team wants to finish there, so they're going to be scrapping for it. And you know they've got Kev Kev's playing up there, who's a former player, so he always brings a lot of sort of intensity. And um, and so is Will Chudley as well. Will Chudley. So I think it's. Um, I'm really looking forward to. It. I like playing in six ways. It's always a decent decent scrap. And now between now and the end of the season, so much to look forward to. Real excitement, some big big games as well. Yeah, it's, it's the, the the season's kind of unfolding, you know, well I think for us, and you start seeing it's not like the light in the tunnel, but it's just start you, you you start putting yourself okay. This is if we do this, this, and this, then we can put ourselves in a decent position to. So far, if we perform well and we win games, we put ourselves in a position to you know win silverware, which is what we want to do, and it's what we're talking about, and it's what's in our minds. So, good performances. We'll get the results and that will lead us to where we want to get to. I've spoken to Marcus, I've spoken to Pat in recent weeks, and uh, both of them have, have praised the input that guys like yourself have helped them in nice their transformation and coming through. And they're, they're, they're putting pressure on you to. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, no, they're 100% putting pressure on you. Yeah, they're, uh, they're going well. So, yeah. What have you made of their growth? Because they're, they're, they're still two relatively young guys coming through in their trade, aren't they? But what have you made of their growth? Um, yeah, I think it's just. I think it's. I think when you're, whether however old or young you are, when you start getting regular get regular game time, you're, you know, you you sort of just get more tricks of the trade, I guess. And um, I mean, good Pat, like Marx is very thorough and he's a very good set piece forward, and Pat is very dynamic. 
Um, the set piece is really good as well. I think they've they, they've been good. It's um yeah, they're sort of there's there's a decent bit of competition within the squad. Nice. Hey,